What is up my dwellers of the interweb, it's Taurus City here and I hope you're all having a fantastic day wherever you are in the world. In this video, we're going to take a look at the game Doctor Who Lost in Time. Now I'm not a huge Doctor Who fan. That's not to say I don't like it, I just don't really watch it a lot. I have watched some of the newer, well I wouldn't really consider it new anymore, but I have watched some of the newer stuff and I did enjoy it. Honestly I would like to get back into it, it's just something I keep forgetting to do. Anyway, so let's try this game out and let's see what it's like. What happened? Emergency landing, something interfered with us in flight, monitor on. Where are we? Earth from the looks of it, some kind of laboratory. Okay, so I'm definitely behind in the doctors. It's been a long time, so I don't know who, which doctor this is. Like, uh, compared to when I last watched it. The TARDIS always lands in the nearest familiar spot. Thing is, I don't know this place. Let's check the room. To, hey, look at this. A unit past Dr. John Smith. Dr. Who? No Time to Lose, Episode 1. We're stuck here in the past then. I wasn't even born yet. Something's keeping the TARDIS here, draining its energy. The drain extends all directions in time. My other selves must be trapped too. Canine. Good dog, I missed you. Who brought you here? You did. Why did I do that? To collect vortex energy from waypoints to power the TARDIS. Oh, that was clever of me. Okay, here we go. The doctor mistress needs your assistance. The TARDIS requires additional energy. Use vortex energy to bring unit lab to online status. Now generate Vortex Energy from Unit Lab three times. When the power indicator is full of Vortex Energy, press the waypoint button to store the accumulated Vortex Energy in the TARDIS. Is it gonna be one of these games? Hold on a second. How long will this take, K9? Duration exceeds maximum human lifespan. Absorption rate must increase. Redirect vortex energy into waypoints to increase output. Right, like how a snowball picks up more snow off the ground as it grows. Affirmative. Power up unit lab to 25. So we gotta use these to speed things up. The whole building is charged with energy, almost as if it had passed through a black hole event horizon. Affirmative, mistress. It has created a space-time waypoint. So the barrier between the space-time continuum and our universe is weakened, and that's impairing the TARDIS. Affirmative, you asked me to remind you to warn your other incarnations. Ah, brilliant. Can you take a message back? Affirmative. Okay, K9, tell all the other doctors the following. Memory gaps, TARDIS is stuck. Send vortex energy. Activate a second waypoint at Dalek City. Affirmative. Keep powering up your waypoints 
and collecting vortex energy to progress in the game. Activate Dalek City. Oh, I need 400? Oh, that didn't take very long, did it? This is the doctor I know. It seems that my TARDIS is stuck in the future and the past. We can't leave Dalek City until we've recharged too. We're in Scar right now, the Dalek's home planet. That what time period? Much later than you and I were last here, by the look of that city. Doctor, you told me once that when you first encountered the Daleks, they all lived in a city and ran on static electricity. Could this be it? Funny, I don't remember that. Why don't I remember? Well, what I do know is that's the waypoint we'll collect Vortex energy from to free the TARDIS. Look at the little grabby hands. Channel a total of 25 units of Vortex Energy into Dalek City. What's this? Waypoint Overlord. Watch a video to get... Uh, another... I, I can't stand those things. Watch a video to get more. Watch a video. <laughs> I mean, at least they give you the option. It's not like shoving it down your throat. I mean, it's still shoving it down your throat, but at least you have the option to watch it or not. all this game is I think this is <laughs> for a Doctor Who game this is a very very plain game like i i would have wanted something a bit more than this but i i know i don't know sometimes when they make these games that are based on like a show or anything they're not always done very well Like this is all I do is just collect the the resource to power this. Yay. Then we read more story. Keep going. According to my sonic screwdriver, we need just a little more. So we'll just keep going. I need a hundred thousand vortex energy. Ooh. So this is all you do. You just wait for these things to power load up more power. Click it. Give it to the other one. How is this fun?
I don't know what how how people find this fun. So at least this one gives off a larger amount. Vortex energy threshold achieved. Brilliant. Okay, bring keep back. Go to the next episode. I'm so not excited. <laughs> what does the little sparky mean exactly? Vortex energy is unrefined, so there may be power surges in the TARDIS console. I was going to do something with my sonic screwdriver, though. That what was it? Was it reverse the polarity? Oh, that's brilliant. Why didn't I think of that? You did. You've said it before, remember? That's the trouble. I don't remember, right? Here goes something. We may have to do this every time we land, at least until I sort out the cause. Tap the TARDIS console as fast as you can to repair it and travel through time and space. Okay, oh, something different. How much sooner do you think? Seek, locate, exterminate? Oh, give or take a week or last Tuesday. Alright. For faster upgrades, channel energy in larger increments by selecting the max option. Available energy will be redirected to increase efficiency by maximum increment. You can switch between buying single or multiple vortex energy power-ups with the max button. This is the exact same thing, but uh, what? Didn't we activate Dal Dalek City already? Why do we have to do it again? friend along to help this time. Canine, so he's dragged you into this too, huh? Oops, won't the Dalek spot him running about? Oh, possibly, but Canine likes a good chase, don't you? Affirmative, Dalek floors are an ideal locomotive surface and I am faster.
travel between waypoints to help speed up the vortex energy collection process. Travel? I can take myself for a walk, mistress. What's this? Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so the the doggy will will help me to get vortex. There's also a temporal positioning system, so you always know where to go. Affirmative, I can continue the collection even when the user interface is inactive. When a waypoint is automated, it will collect even when you're out of, away from the game. Alright, now that's sorted, what do we do about the Daleks? First, we need to find out how they get out so early. They must have had help. From whom? The Thals aren't likely to be helping the Daleks, are they? And second, get captured by a Dalek patrol. Halt, do not move. You have been captured by the Daleks. Nope, not moving. We surrender. Prisoners will follow for interrogation. Move, move, move. You know, I think I've been to Dalek City before, but I can't remember when. They must. This must be connected to my memory loss, or I'd have forgotten that. What's that over there? It looks like sort of like a TARDIS. A Dalek time ship. Ah, they helped themselves. Rewrote their own history. Prisoners will remain silent. Obey, obey, obey. So I don't need to do this one anymore. The doggy's claiming it for me. Still trying to figure out what is, what, like is this? This is all I do. This is all I do, right? There's nothing else to it. Just keep collecting and then progress the story. Time ship is still non-functional due to unknown power drain. We must resume our mission. Repair the time ship. Repair, repair. Okay, so we can go to the next episode. Whatever immobilized the TARDIS is also affecting them. But they don't have access to energy from the other waypoints like we do. Maybe we could offer to fix the time machine for them, you know? Helping like cats help. Oh, brilliant. myself to upgrade waypoints. K9 which button stops the... okay. 
So this is Gallifrey then, your home planet? How cool is that? Yes, cool. I need access to the untempered schism to obtain Henok matter. Before you ask, I need a supply of Henok matter to help speed things about up. The untempered schism is a riz <laughs> The untempered schism is a rip in space time. We're ritually exposed to it as children. That explains so much about why you are, you know, like that. Does it really? No. So now we have to start again. Why is it every episode you have to start again? Oh, I even have to like manually do this until I get like 25,000 vortex jeez Again, I, I say the same thing again. How is this fun? I, I, I don't mind if every episode we just have to, you know, unlock the next one and then we still have the benefits of the last. Why do we have to start all the way from the beginning every time? Alright, well, at least the first one's back to automated again. You can make him even you can give the canine the option to automate the other ones as well okay well that makes things a little bit easier You may use matrix representation icons and adaptive neogenesis molecules. He means waypoint cards in Henoch matter. Yes, Dr. Master, to upgrade waypoints and increase efficiency. Spend cards in Henoch matter to upgrade your waypoints so that they'll produce more vortex energy. Okay. 
upgrade. So, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how much more I can take in this game. It's just not that interesting. Alright, telling me to buy some free stuff. There's, there's, an ev there's like a... Does a big Doctor Who fan even really enjoy this game? Oh look at that, now we can get, we can, they're telling me to go buy a 4 hour skip time thingy. <laughs> to speed uh, a boost so that you get more items. Uh, so you get more vortex energy. Yeah, okay. Okay, so you can upgrade. That's great. Alright, yeah, I I, <laughs> I gave it a try, I gave it a try, and uh, it's just, this is, this is, this is not for me. I don't know, I just don't, I just, I just don't find it fun, and you, what we're doing, we're just, we're just pushing buttons, we can get, we can make them, the K9 unit automated more. And that's it. We can go to the next episode now. And then it will probably start again from the beginning. <laughs> Alright, I think that's it for this uh, game. I can't, I can't play any more of that. <sighs> there we go. So that's my first 30 minutes of Doctor Who Lost in Time. I honestly did not enjoy my time in this game. Um, I'm not sure who would, but I guess if you enjoy just repeating the same stuff over and over again and then starting from scratch every time you go to the next episode, then I guess maybe you'd like it, but I don't. Yeah, this is not a game for me. So, anyway, that's that's all I got to say about this game. It's just really boring. <laughs> oh, yeah. Anyway, I have an I'll have a proper first impression video on this coming up soon. So, take care everyone. Have a good day. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.